local forecast with meteorologist Jackson Chastain starts now. Well, we've got beautiful blue skies in places like Kinzers, and that's really across the entire mid state. You can also see uh, the wind blowing at this very busy construction site right now. Uh, this uh, plastic wrap or, or what I assume is plastic wrap blowing around in the wind. Uh, live look from Newville as well, where you also have some beautiful blue skies, but the camera is shaking quite a bit and uh, wind is really something that you're going to have to consider uh, when you're going outdoors today. Temperatures at the moment sitting at about 52 degrees in Harrisburg, 54 Carlisle, 56 in Chambersburg and 52 in Lancaster. So low 50s in most places, upper 40s into the north and to the west. As you get through the rest of the day today, we're going to hit about 54, 55 in the afternoon. So very, very seasonable for this time of year. And, you know, I know that's not the most comfortable temperature in the world, but it is something that you uh, should be able to go out and enjoy relatively. This is off the back of a low pressure system that is off to our east. You also have a low pressure system off to our northwest, and that's actually going to bring some shower activity heading into the weekend. So uh, not expecting anything for today for Friday. But heading into Saturday, something to watch out for. So let's actually time that out for you because the rest of the evening tonight's going to be a nothing burger. Nothing's going to happen. Not expecting anything going on there. Then early Friday, Saturday afternoon, you start to see some of these scattered showers moving on into the region. They're going to be light in nature initially and intensity will pick up as we get further along. So closer to your dinner time and a little bit after that, you're starting to see some of these oranges and reds make their way with some of these embedded showers. And this is as you can see, relatively scattered in its distribution that will continue close to midnight before things actually start to clear out and dry out. So thankfully for your Sunday, I know heading into Easter weekend, you want a perfectly clear weekend, but at least the Easter Sunday itself, when you're going to church and all that, things will be good to go. Now, closer to lunchtime, there is some potential for the stray shower there. That's heading into a Monday in the morning. We're also watching for some winds to uh, to push on through uh, in terms of rain totals about a quarter of an inch uh, beyond that. Not a whole lot to uh, look forward to in terms of heavy precipitation. Those winds themselves persisting, uh, calming down, then picking back up, heading into your Sunday and then calming back down, heading into your Monday. So uh, kind of two distinct days where you've got winds that you're contending with. But overall, I would say a decent outlook for your weekend. You kind of wish that Saturday wasn't rainy, but at least, like you said earlier in the show, Sunday, the main day, is the day that we have a, a, dry, uh, a dry outdoor condition. All right, Jackson, thank you very much. We'll be right back.